Hey everybody, welcome back to Montreal Connected. Now, they were the darlings of the Canadian Olympic team and have become the first family of freestyle skiing. Together, the DeFore LaPointe sisters helped Canada win seven medals in that sport at the Winter Games. Finally, back at home after the end of the World Cup season, the girls recently took time to sit down with our Kelly Gregg for this interview. Well, from Pointe aux Trombes to the world stage, I'm joined now by Justine, Chloe, and Maxime Dufour La Pointe. Ladies, thank you so much for joining me. Thank Hi. you. Now, after the Olympics, you're obviously household names across Canada. You're back in Montreal for the first time since the Games. How has your life changed from then to now? I think um, we're, it's just so crazy right now. We're in a real tornado, and it just doesn't stop right now. So it's kind of cool. Um, I think. We're really enjoying the ride. It's really great. We're feeling a lot of love from the people who saw us at the Olympic game, and it's great, actually. We love like hearing their feedback because we were such in a bubble, so we couldn't really understand or realize the impact that we create when we went to the Olympics. So, you know, it's really awesome. And for you ladies, I mean, you just said you were in a bubble. Is it all kind of surreal right now, what's going on? Well, for sure. we. we we took some time to realize what is real and what is not, but uh, <laughs> I mean, um, it's just so good to be home and to have the, all the feedback from uh, people who saw us. It's, it's touching. It, yeah. It's so touching. We didn't realize how much impact it could have. I like hearing about people's stories, how we touched us, how they like seeing Ch Justine cry or how they have girls or little boys at home who watch the games and were like, amazed by what we did and we were just doing what we always do and that's skiing and it's amazing that we touched so many people. Well you said that you do it like you always do but obviously you were there at the games together. Do you think that it would have been a different experience if you weren't all together? What would it have been like? How much do you support each other? Well to, to be together it was amazing. We dreamed of uh, to be the three of us at the game. And I guess uh, it helped us perform because we were feeling at home because it's our habit to be together and to help each other. Either way, it, we had good or bad days. So we had such a good time. We were able to laugh every day, make some joke. And yeah, it was just like the time of our life. Perfect. Well, I mean, freestyle skiing really grabbed the attention of all Canadians across the country with your success and the success of your teammates. But it really hasn't been on the international scene or in Canadians' minds much since probably the days for women of Jen Heil. And how do you feel about, you know, you being the new faces of freestyle skiing for women? What's that like? Well, I think we're lucky. We're, it, it, we're so lucky that it happened to us, but I think it's amazing for the sport. Uh, it needs support. It's it's a small sport. It's just where the parents are great. The support system is awesome. The Canadian Freestyle Association is doing a great job at pulling a system which works. We've seen it at the Olympics, seven medalists. I mean, it's incredible. So I hope it drags people in and people that will be interested either to play a part in the sport, being athlete, or just help sponsors and. I think it's an amazing thing for our sport. I think we're so glad that like you, you compare us to Janine and for me when I was a kid I was like so impressed by her and I remember like for me she was my inspiration. So it's it's a big title to take uh, but uh, I think we're we're going to get maybe try to get some tip from her. <laughs> Not bad advice. I mean I've always wondered personally, you guys make it look effortless when you're on the hill. It looks like, you know, just another day. What's it like when you're going down, flying over the jumps? Describe to me the experience of actually freestyle skiing in Moguls. Well, it's, it, I think it's nice that you say that it seems easy because it's, it's, <laughs> it's what it's we what, what, Yeah, it's what, what we it should be. <laughs> Making the hard stuff look easy and the easy stuff look hard, right? Exactly, yeah. but I think we have so much training behind the scene, such a good people around us who coach us and give us really good advice and I think it's what makes it so beautiful and so easy because we have trained so hard during months and months of training camp so yeah it's it's I think it's the goal 
Perfect. Well, ladies, thank you so much for joining me. We're really proud to have you here. Thank you so much, and best of luck in all the rest of your endeavors. Thank, thank you. you. <laughs>